Good morning students. My name is Shani. I'm from GK Jane School. Today we're going to see about third standard science unit one, my body. Yesterday we have seen how to protect our sense organ. How to protect our eyes. If we are seeing TV, we have to maintain a distance of 12 feet. If there is any itching happen in your eyes, immediately you have to wash and clean or in cold water. So you have to avoid watching TV, may so much of hours or playing video games. It is good for your eyes. So you have to avoid watching too much of TV or playing video games. Then about our ears. We should not use any earbuds to clean our ears. You have to cover your ears while taking a bath. It is good so that the water will not enter your ears. Then avoid hearing too much of sound, volume, noise or like song. So you have to avoid hearing so much loud sound music. You can avoid that so that your eardrums will not be damaged. Then about the nose, you should not pluck your nose. You can clean it with water or if you have cold, you can clean it with steam, steam water. Then about our tongue, you should, while brushing daily, you should clean your tongue daily. It is good for your health. Then about your skin, you have to use only a mild soap which will not harm your skin. If there is any itching happens in your skin, you have to consult a doctor. So these are the things we learn for protecting our sense organ. So today we are going to learn about good touch and bad touch. Let us see about the good touch, bad touch. So good touch and bad touch are the words most commonly used to explain what touch is okay and what is not okay. So good touch is a touch that cares for you or cares for us or make us feel safe and comfortable. So the good touch is the cares. It is a caring touch. It feels us safe and comfortable. But bad touch will not feel as comfortable. It's uncomfortable. Feel as scared. It's not a caring touch. So the touch, bad touch it makes us feel scared and uncomfortable. Whereas a good touch, it cares for us and makes us feel safe and comfortable. So rule number one. So what are the rules we go see here? Rule number one. The lips, chest, between your legs and your buttocks. You can see your lips. Chest, between your legs and your buttocks are called as a private parts. So no one have rights to look or touch or talk about your private parts. So the lips, chest, between your legs and buttocks are called your private parts. So these parts should never be touched by anyone. So no one have rights for touching or looking or talking about your private parts. It is never right for anyone to look at, touch or talk about your private parts. And it is never right for someone older to you to ask you to look, touch or talk about the private parts. Even if someone asks you to look, touch or talk about other private, pa others private parts, you should never do this. This is the rule number one. So, no one should touch your private parts or you should not touch other 
look, touch or talk about other private parts. So rule number two. So as soon as something happened to you, should immediately scream, stop and run away from the place. If someone touches you, your private parts should run away from the place, should scream, scream, stop and run away. You should shout loudly. So you should not let anyone to touch you. If they are coming and touching you, you have to shout immediately. You have to scream. So if you receive a badge, you must say don't touch in a loud voice. And immediately you have to leave the place. So rule number three. Tell everything to your parents, especially to your mother. So whatever has happened, have to first inform your parents to your mother. Don't share your address and phone numbers with the strangers. You should not share your address or phone number to the strangers. Don't answer the phone or open the door without any adults present. So you should not open any door. Or phone, answer the phone without any adults present. Never eat anything you get from the strangers. You should not eat anything which you get from your strangers. Have emergency telephone number with you. Your mother, father, brother, sister numbers you should have. So keep telling until you get the help you need. So you have to tell it. You should not get afraid for telling this to your parents. So immediately if anything bad happens, you have to inform your parents. So you can inform the safe circle members, father, mother, grandpa, grandma, sister, brother and your teacher. Not your friends. You have to inform to your family members like father, mother, grandpa, grandma, sister, brother and immediately to your teachers. The helpline number is 10 Nine eight. You can call the helpline number one zero nine eight. So the first rule number what we have seen, the rule number one, you should not allow anyone to touch your private parts, your lips, your chest, between your legs and your buttocks. So you should not allow anyone to see, touch, or talk about that. You also should not. Talk about others' private parts. That is rule number one. Rule number two, you should shout immediately if you are in a problem. You should quickly run away from the place. Rule number three, you should inform what have happened to your parents, to your safe circle members, father, mother, grandpa, grandma, sister, brother and teacher. For help. So the admission is going for pre-KG to 11th standard. You can contact our school 7338939363 and visit our school site www.gkjainschool.origin and our Facebook page GK Jain School. Instagram GK Jain School, Twitter GK Jain School. So only limited seats are available. So you can rush up for our school. Thank you students. Tomorrow I will see you in another session.